Perhaps God was the original rebel. He saw darkness, and with an intense boiling in his soul, he said, This ought not be so. He spoke the word and scattered a riot of color across time and space. He created suns 10,000 times the size of our own and violated the night with happiness, light, music, and dancing. In his frenzy, he created galaxies, hundreds of thousands of light years across, and tiny particles of matter, information, words, if you will, hundreds of thousands of times smaller than the period at the end of this sentence. Perhaps had God been satisfied with things as they were, had he preferred to play it safe, to leave well enough alone, to let darkness conform to darkness, had he simply moved on in the dimensions that he occupied, then creation never would have happened. But he was not satisfied, so he spoke, let there be light.